Hello everyone, I am Dr. Sarah Suleri and I would like to welcome you all to the paper presentation of UI Sketch, a large scale dataset of UI element sketches. UI Sketch dataset is the first large scale dataset of 17,979 hand drawn sketches of 21 UI element categories collected from 967 participants, including UI UX designers, front end developers, HCI and CS grad students from 10 different countries. Before delving into the details of this paper and what it contributes, I would like to establish some background on this area of research. Recent research where HCI and AI interacts, we require large scale data sets to train AI models. In UI design research, currently, the two large data sets we have are Rico and Swire. Rico contains around 72,000 UI screenshots, and Swire contains about 3,800 low fee screens. Swire was sketched by five designers, and it is specific for the GUI similarity search system. Also, it does not have annotations for training any other supervised learning models. On the other hand, Research in sketch recognition uses these other large datasets, so we wanted to create a large dataset for UI low fee prototypes and understand how humans and computers recognize UI element sketches. We approached the research following the footsteps of prior research in collecting drawings of real life objects. First, we identified a list of UI element categories that needed to be included in the dataset, then we created questionnaires and collected the respective sketches from participants. In both the paper and digital questionnaires, we show a sample UI element image on the left-hand side that we randomize to get varied sketches, even if the user traces it. On the right-hand side, we provide a sketching area. We use these questionnaires, and over a span of three years, we collected UI element sketches from 967 participants from 10 different countries. Our participants included UI UX designers with 2 to 14 years of prior prototype experience, front-end developers, HCI and CS grad students. These sketches were collected with pen and pencil using a paper questionnaires. However, in the digital questionnaires, we restricted them only to use styluses. Once we collected all these sketches, we started our data processing. For this, we created a script that takes the paper questionnaire as input and uses contour detection to return labeled, close cropped element sketches. We then manually verified these sketches. We removed badly drawn, contaminated, and irrelevant sketches to finalize this data set. This dataset contains around 70% of digital sketches and 30% of paper sketches. We tried as much as possible to keep the classes balanced, so we have about 850 images for each UI element category. With this dataset, we first wanted to analyze the drawing conventions and the differences between the sketches created by experienced designers and novices. The key difference was in the level of details added to the sketch. Experienced designers and developers tend to keep the sketches minimal, whereas novice designers such as HCI and CS grad students added more detail to each sketch. To set a baseline, we conducted another study with 76 UI UX designers where we showed them UI element sketches and asked them to identify their categories. Our results show that designers can identify UI element sketches with 96% accuracy. To understand how they identify the UI elements, we looked at the UI elements that they mostly confused. We observed that human recognition errors are usually caused due to the confusion between semantically similar UI element categories. Moving on, we trained 26 different image and sketch classification neural networks and identified that current state-of-the-art neural networks could identify UI element sketches with around 80 to 90% accuracy. The best performing model was ResNet 152 with 92% accuracy. We further looked at how they identified these UI elements and found that computational recognition errors are solely caused due to the confusion between the structural similarity of UI element categories. To further analyze the reasoning behind why the model confuses few UI element categories, we use its ResNet-152 model as a feature tracker, along with TSNE, to reduce the dimensionality of the test dataset images and plotted them as a 2D graph. This graph clearly shows that the computational classification model clusters the image based on the structural similarities, unlike humans. This dataset can be used for a lot of potential applications. Recently, a number of research projects attempted to automate transformation of low-fee sketches to code. As this dataset contains varied sketches, we can generate synthetic low prototypes using the dataset and train such models. Another application would be to retrieve inspirational UI designs by sketching. This dataset could help train these AI models as well. Finally, we could also create sketch autocompletion to support designers while sketching low prototypes. We would also like to highlight a few limitations and how we want to address them in our future work. Currently, this dataset only covers smartphone platform. In the future, we would like to collect more sketches for other platforms as well. Similarly, we would like to collect sketches of low-fee screens as well. Finally, as we mentioned earlier, this dataset is provided as open access, so you can find it in Kegel using this link. I would like to thank all of you for your time and attention. Please contact us if you have any questions.